What's up YouTube? It's your boy Douglas M. Uh, today I'll be going over uh, my 4.1.1 Jelly Bean update um, on my rooted Samsung Note 10.1. So let's just wait for this to load up here. It loads up very fast so we'll just wait for it to load. Now again my device is rooted so I don't know if the official um, for for non-rooted devices came out, but because mine is rooted, I have to update mine manually every time. So anyway, without further ado, let's go into my settings and just show you what I'm running here. Zoom in. All right. So my if you want to know, my Note is the Wi-Fi only version. It's the only versions of notes and tablets that I buy personally, but my version is the 8013. Uh, as you see there, I'm running Android 4.1.1 and I am running the something build, which is pretty funny. If you noticed um, on the bottom, it has a blue theme and also in the corner, I'm trying zoom in so you guys could see it has the battery um, battery life indicator or whatever gauge yep so that's something new that I'm not used to seeing this has been rooted for about a week no about two weeks now um, but didn't really play much around with it but um, I'll show you what I've noticed um, with the update and first uh, of course if I hold down the home button like so see that Google uh, uh, circle that came up there if I flick my finger anywhere Google Play sh Google now sorry should come up and uh, there it is make sure my volumes up so you can hear yes yeah, so I was on mute when I turn it on okay so um Peyton Manning's height Peyton Manning is six feet five inches tall Stephen A. Smith's age Stephen A. Smith is 45 years old Wow all right so that's just a you know a brief example of um, you know Google now I'm sure you guys are um, might be a little accustomed to it. Yeah, let's do one more. What's the weather today? Today's forecast for Greensboro is 46 degrees and clear. Hmm. Okay. All right. With my update, um, I did, uh, um, well, included in my, um, up my root update. Uh, to Jelly Bean, I got the premium um, package or whatever you call it um, that that uh, that comes with Jelly Bean, and we'll just start going over that now. If you noticed um, on the bottom uh, middle of my, of the screen right there, it looks kind of like a book, a open book, whatever that is, that icon. If I click it, um, well. Look on the bottom left right there. I'll try and zoom in so you can see. It says uh, Cascade View. So I can click that or get Dual View. Either one. So let's... I guess the Cascade View means that you can, um, you can view multiple things um, at once. So let's just try that out. Uh, let's put the calculator up. Right. Let's... Uh, Let's get the internet up. And click on something. Uh, all right. Let's click on. Yeah, of course. S note. And I can move these around. Uh, 
I'll leave it at that. Oh, you know what? I think I, I'll put video player on. And we'll put... Do I have any? I don't think I have any videos that I can play. Without getting in trouble. But I'm going to play one anyway. I got my son's crap in there. Let's see. Bup, 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 bup. Must be something in here. No? Oh, there. There we go. We got something there. We'll pop that in there. Turn the volume down. Oh, almost knocked over my drink. So I'll move that over there. Um, so we got that going. Oh, so that finished already. So, as you can see, do oh, okay. I got all of these open. I just change it to dual view. I guess that's what I meant to do. See, got all of these running at the same time, just to give you, you know, a quick, you know, example of that. I can, you know, put it to full screen. I could take it out of full screen. I can pin it. See that pin right there? Move my drink out the way. All right. If you see that pin on the the upper, if I upper left, if I click that, then it stays there. It doesn't move. You know, I can't move it then. Well, I mean, it will stay there unless I, you know, nothing will get in front of you. It will just stay. Take my S Pen out and, you know, could pick, oh, and it's got that preview thing that you guys probably know about. See that? That's pretty cool. So, yeah, the premium uh, package is pretty cool. Another thing I noticed um, uh, with this update um, is how you can manage and create your folders. Um, I just created a, well, then just, but I have a folder there called Utilities. And when I click on it, it's a bunch of different apps in one folder that is easy to create, as you see right there. I'm going to show you right now. So if I press down, and click folder can name it whatever I want right so let me move it over here so you can see it right and so when I click to the upper this when I click to the upper right to my apps I can just take anything throw it in there right um Gmail throw it in there video editor oh. throw it in there and I'll just put one more we'll go ahead and put the Samsung app store and that's what it looks like so it jumbles all your your apps you throw in the folder and the one you can kind of see a bit of each one of them when I click it that's what it looks like so I don't know how much you can put in there but I put like at one point I had like 10 apps in my um, my utilities uh, icon and it was all in there so I don't, I don't know how much you can but I don't think you'll have a problem with fitting as many apps as you need in there I'm trying to think, is there any new apps that I've seen that was just baked into the update that I noticed? I'm thinking Groupcast. I'm thinking that I might be wrong on that, but I know the Paper Artist thing is new for me anyway. I've never seen that uh, prior. So. That's pretty much all I got as far as new apps that I noticed. It might be one or two other ones, but um, that's all I noticed. 
And lastly, I did notice when you're about to turn off your device, hold on that, you get some extra stuff here. So yeah, that that's what you get. But anyway, it's your boy Douglas Sam. Thanks for looking. I uh, remember to subscribe. Hit me up with any uh, comments or questions in your comments um, that you may have. And if anything, uh, thanks for looking at my video. And stay tuned for other Samsung videos I may have.